Denver versus <laughs> versus LA. Um the Lakers, to their credit, man, they they look like monsters defensively. I still think the offense is pretty weak, but like defensively, they look like monsters out there. That will be tested. Right? Yes. Like that that's gonna be tested. And all this talk of uh, AD defense this and AD defense that it's been there, but they don't have the size they had the last time they played Denver in the playoffs in the bubble to contend with Jokic. Like this is now like Anthony Davis has to guard him every possession. I guess they can dust off Mo Bamba if his ankle's the, okay, but like they have they LeBron have, guard him. No, you can't. No, do no that. not 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 at this not at but, this late in his career. I don't think you could. Not consistent. Like maybe a, the, a, a de- like a possession here, possession switch, there, but not yes. enough to like the, make it a strategy. The, the only reason why I would suggest that is because they need Anthony Davis protecting the rim. Agreed. And if Anthony yes. Davis yeah, is yeah. out guarding Jokic at the arc, then they they're gonna have Reeves, Schroeder, Russell on the back line. Like I just don't think that's big enough. I think they might have to try LeBron at some point in this series, at least for a little while, to keep LeBron to keep AD near the rim to have him guard Aaron Gordon to take away I mean, some of that stuff. May, if you play zone like almost exclusively, then yeah, I, I mean maybe, but I I think like man, I, I don't get me wrong, LeBron's fucking strong. Like LeBron is obviously like a a, a physical beast, but Jokic just pushes monsters around like it's nothing like yoke like yoke is just like bumps a guy and they then they fall back he shoves a guy like they fall back on the post like there's nothing physically like i don't know how many people can can physically do that and i just i don't think i mean lebron will have leverage for being the low man and all that shit like there's some science behind it but for the most part like yoke just moves people he moves these big guys out of the way i don't know if lebron can physically hold up and then on the other, like, is this foot okay? Is he trying to do that on one foot still? Like, I just, I don't know what, like, what he would then be able to give on the other end of the floor. Maybe I'm, I'm doubting LeBron too much. I just, I think that's asking way too much of a 38 year old. Three or four years ago, I think that'd be a, the right thing to do, Jay. You could have done was, in the bubble for sure. Yeah. yeah I think in the bubble, yeah, that could have been something. Yeah. I, I, I don't know if LeBron could hold up and do that and then do what he has to do on the offensive end as well. And I think that's going to be one of those things again, like we're, we are talking about it with Jimmy Butler. I think that's a tough one to ask of LeBron to do. It's going to be a hard, hard job for AD defensively this series. But if they're going to move on, he needs to be that guy that everybody tells us, all the Laker fans tell us. He's this guy and all that. He needs to be that guy, not for one game, not not one good game, bad game, good game. He needs to be the whole fucking series, and that's going to be the deal for them. 